Hello and welcome to a Lego set review. Da -da -da. Today I am doing Lego set 76001, the Bat Bane Tumbler Chase. Uh, this set is £40 and can be found in most of the leading toy shops. It's um, in wave 2 of the DC Universe superhero sets. Um, yeah, so I'll do a bigger close up first. There is Batman. He's got very cool chest printing on him. Very cool back printing on him. Very good cape, as you can see, it's with spiky thin jigs. It's got a helmet on and if you take off the helmet that's its face, it's the other face, same as the usual Batman figures. Uh, now probably the best figure that comes with this set is Good back printing and good back face printing, which is pretty rare for a Lego figure because it's not a double sided face figure, it's just back printing. And it's got one white hand and one black hand for some reason. Don't know why. And finally, how many times for three figures? Our final figure is Commissioner Gordon. Good SWAT jacket on him. Got a gun which is probably a normal, usual gun. Get quite a few of those in one of the draught cassettes. Uh, that's his hairpiece. Daisy, Daisy. Um, his head, pretty cool. And then his other head, he's got two faces. Okay, now this set comes with two of these. They are pretty much what do you call them? Stop. Barriers. Okay. That the bear, I think it's something like the bane tumbler comes across them and can't get past them, so it just destroys them. And it comes with two of those. Now we move on to. on the front that is a sticker it's got cool sticker there which you can open and put bang in there it's got two two flip pencils either side or fire them down it's got fire on the back of it and that's the base just got four buttons and four wheels which can spin it. and it's pretty good at spinning 
sometimes it does make a noise. And now the main feature of this set probably is the bat. Very, very cool indeed. Now, start at there. As you can see, there is the bat signal or bat sign. There's a lift up in there, and you can actually fit two figures in there one there and one behind. So, Commissioner Gordon and Batman, and other ones, or anyone else. There's two of these things. On each side, uh, there's like these top things here which can flap open like the hat, and flap open like that. If you look on the back, there's this, there's a sticker there and there. And some light lights and things there. And now we go to the back where it's that. And what I think is very, very cool. You get for instance a figure like Commissioner Gordon, and you see this string. Let me just fix it on. You can hang a figure from there. And as you may be able to see from the snapshots, there is also two spinny things which are really just jetpacks. Now, this set comes with two instruction manuals. The first instruction manual, at the end, you pretty much produce that, which is the thing. Pull back around with instructions and then think they're new for the Batman new way. And the second one, which is cool as well, at the end we produce that, but you also make those two lights as I showed you on earlier. Okay, so that was what that was the close up of the set. Now um I like this set quite a lot. Um I like the Bane figure, I think that's a very good detailed figure. Do you know what I mean? Um the Bane Tumble is a very, very fun build. It's good for young children. The bat's quite a complicated build for some boys in there. Uh good usage of fire for the Bane Tumbler, I think, at the bat back. Uh what do I not like about the Bane Tumbler? Um It's weird because with the wheels sometimes when you Squish them along when they're like on uh, what do you call it? Concrete. Concrete. Sometimes it makes this really weird noise, like a screeching noise, and it just stops completely. But on carpet, I think it's fine. Yeah, it's fine on carpet. Um, uh, anything else I don't like about that set? Uh, not bit. No, not really. I quite like that bit actually. Uh, the lights I do quite like, they're quite good. Nice picture. Um, I like about the bat how they have their string and everything, and I quite like these bits. Um, what does I like about the bat? Uh, hmm, quite like the bat actually, I don't know why I could improve on that. Uh, Maybe make it a bit more easier to build because that's some of the pages. It was a tiny bit too complicated. Um, I think they're pretty clear instruction manuals, except from, as I said, some pages with the back. Um, anything? Okay, so that's that. Um, 
I would probably rate this uh, uh, probably seven and a half out of ten, or maybe seven point six, seven point four. I don't know, it's quite a good set. Um, I would say if you bought it, it's a um, good addition to the back DC universe. And it's good because this is the only set that I think this is the only set you can get Commissioner Gordon in. Um, yeah, so anything else you can think about that? Really much? Uh, yeah, so that's about it, so see you next time for another LEGO Re-